Hi, I'm Brett from papercartridges.com. It just stopped hailing and there's enough light left to take this quick video of the model 1885 Remington Lee. So when it came out in 1885, this was among the most advanced military small arms in the world. And the model 1879 that this is based on is the first detachable box magazine rifle ever adopted by any military power and was the basis for the more famous Lee Enfield, the same James Paris Lee designed the magazine in action for this rifle. We got maybe 10 minutes of good light left, so I'm just gonna shoot it. Five rounds of 4570 in a detachable box magazine. That is fun. So when this was adopted in small numbers by the Navy, unlike the later Lee Enfield, which was always loaded individually or on uh, charger clips later on, Additional magazines were issued to the sailors and Marines that uh, had this rifle. So it truly was a magazine loaded rifle instead of a charger clip fed rifle that happens to have a magazine that detaches for easier cleaning. So in many ways, this is the grandfather of the M16, the M4 carbine, the standard infantry weapons that are still in use today. Running out of light. I knocked the target down. <laughs> well, at least we know we're hitting, right? Well, they're going a little low, but uh, hey, for a <laughs> 1885 black powder rifle offhand in the rain, not bad. This is not going to get old. 4570 magazine fed bolt action rifle. All that smoke. <laughs> Get any more fun than that. If you have a Lee rifle and a box magazine, you got to do this at least once.
but you can't see what you're shooting at. <laughs> okay, it's out of my system, I promise. The Remington Lee was a magazine rifle, but being an 1880s military firearm, there was a provision to essentially turn it into a one-shot, single-loading rifle like the old Trapdoor Springfield. Commanders like to have this option so that their soldiers wouldn't shoot away all their magazines and be out of ammunition. So when the magazine is released, a little spring-loaded tab pops out and in essence, turns this into a single shot rifle. So the Marines and sailors with their bandoliers of loaded magazines also had individual rounds and on order, they could load and fire this just like a regular old single shot trapdoor rifle. And to my knowledge, I could be wrong, no one has actually shot a Model 1885 on video before. And again, I could be wrong. I haven't spent too much time searching, but uh, we'll do it today. That little lever acts uh, as a feeding ramp and prevents the round just from falling through the hole where the magazine goes. And then you just load it like any other single shot rifle. Not too bad for <laughs> offhand at unknown distance. I'd say no more than maybe 60 yards. Um, all over minute of bad guy. So, uh, you know, President Taft, uh, his sailors and Marines, I think they would have been in pretty good hands with a, a Model 1885 Remington Lee. And fast bolt, accurate out of the box, pleasant to shoot mild recoil and it's in 4570 can't beat that um, i'm happy with it it's a excellent transitional period rifle i'm going to shoot it a lot more thanks for watching